but she bolted up in that grade three pre juinier at Otoy last time and she just ploughs through testing conditions relentlessly. Nothing ever threatened to get in a blow against her last time. And this race has been her target for some time. Valserlido and Apache Stronghold obviously closely matched on Cheltenham form. Gilgan Boa, chance two. From on the outside in second place is Dorian, the Tuller Tank and Gilgam Boa. Close in behind with also towards the inside Val Salido, the grey smashing just on the heels of the leaders. They come out over the first and Gaten de Berlay is the leader. Azorian on the outside being followed by the Tuller Tank, Gilgam Boa and smashing her next, followed by Val Salido as they come round the bend and face up now towards the second fence noble emperor is followed by apache stronghold dropped in at the rear of the field first of the three in the straight gatan de berlay from azorian the teller tank in third and smashing four gilgam boa next valser leader on the inside and then followed by noble emperor and the back marker is apache stronghold so they're on now towards the fourth which will be the fence in front of the stands of course the final one next time and Gatan de Berlay and Ruby Walsh lead, Azori and Robbie Power. Then comes the Teller Tank and Adrian Eskin with smashing towards the near side, landing in third for Johnny Burke. Gil Gamboa, Tony McCoy on the inside, a couple of lengths to Noble Emperor. Not Matt. Cork result stands. Result stands at Cork, no alterations. There's an objection by the clerk of the scales to the, the rider of the second, though, at Sedgefield. Let's go back to Fairy House. Ryanair Gold Cup novice chase. Gatan de Berlay from Azorian on the outside. They're tracked by the Grey Smashing. Tuller Tank is fourth. Gil Gamboa five. Noble Emperor, Val Salido, and Apache Stronghold. First of the three up the side of the track. And Gatan de Berlay from Azorian on the outside. Smashing is a close up third. And they're being followed. A uh, slight mistake there by Noble Emperor towards the outside. Gil Gamboa and the Tuller Tank are next. And then Apache Stronghold and Val Salido at this ditch now, heading away from the stands. And Gatan de Berlay leads, smashing landed in second. Azorian followed by Gil Gambo and the Teller Tank, Noble Emperor, Apache Stronghold and Val Salido. Going now to the next fence, they climb up towards the top of the hill. And Gatan de Berlay is the leader from smashing. Azorian is third and Gil Gamboa is racing in fourth place, being followed by... On the outside, Noble Emperor, the Tuller Tank next, a couple of lengths to Val Salido and Apache Stronghold as they continue right up now towards the top of the track. And Gatan de Berlay leads from in second place, smashing. Third place is Azorian and four Gil Gamboa. Right up now at Ballyhack and Gatan de Berlay from smashing in second. In third place, Azorian and four is Gil Gamboa. On the descent now down towards the next fence, the Tuller Tank is next. Val Salido towards the inside of Noble Emperor and Apache Stronghold. At the next, Gatan de Berlay, smashing his second and third as his Orient, and lost one at the back there, Apache Stronghold. So they continue on now down the far side and begin the run now towards the next on the far side. Gatan de Berlay leads by three, smashing is followed by Gil Gamboa, and then comes on the outside as Zorian with the Tullo Tank and Val Salido, and Noble Emperor is just the back marker. And Paul Carberry happily on his feet, racing across now towards the next. Gatan de Berlay from smashing Azorian, Gil Gamboa, the Tuller Tank. Noble Emperor is next, and the back marker just is Valserlido. And it's Gatan de Berlay who'll take them across now with four to jump in the Ryanair Gold Cup with just over a length lead to smashing Azorian. Gil Gamboa on the inside. Then Valserlido trying to creep closer on the inside of the Tuller Tank and Noble Emperor. They're tightly enough grouped now with four to jump. Gatan de Berlay from smashing Azorian Gil Gamboa. Then comes Val Salido, the Tuller Tank, and Noble Emperor. They're on the run now to the fence before they'll swing for home. Three left to jump. Gatan de Berlay and Ruby Walsh in front, smashing Johnny Burke second. Third, Gil Gamboa, Tony McCoy. Val Salido creeping closer on the inside for Paul Town, and as they jump this one and begin now to make the run for home. Gatan de Berlay in the lead from smashing Gil Gamboa. Noble Emperor improving on the outside of the Tuller Tank, racing round the 
home turn. Two fences left to jump. Gatan de Berlay from smashing. Gil Gamboa has been ridden. Then comes Noble Endeavour and then the Tullow Tank as they come now towards the second last. Gatan de Berlay pressed by smashing on the near side. In third is Gil Gamboa. Now they race towards the second last. Smashing and Johnny Burke. Gatan de Berlay on the far side. Ruby Walsh. Not much between them as they come down towards the final fence. In third is Gil Gamboa. They're racing now towards the final fence in the Ryanair Gold Cup. And it's smashing Gil Gamboa on the far and making ground on the near side. Gatan de Berlay the far side. At the last, nothing between the three. And away from it, Gil Gamboa on the near side of smashing as they run up towards the finish. Gil Gamboa and Tony McCoy in the J.P. McManus colours is going to win for Enda Bulger from a fast finishing the Tuller Tank. Close for third, Gatan de Berlay and smashing and fifth home, Noble Emperor.